Today we're going to make a covered bridge with Timberworks toys. We're going to start with four square connectors. Then we're going to put in a three inch timber. You're just going to put it vertically up and down into each of the connectors. And then you're also going to place a rotated 12 inch notch timber. Make sure it's a rotated notch timber and not all the same notches. You place that into your square connector along with the three inch piece. Make sure all of them are the same way as far as the notches. Make them the same way as the three inch timber is. After you're finished with that, put a 12 inch timber going across to the other. Then you're going to place another 12 inch timber on the other side. We're going to place square connectors on each end. We're going to do the same thing for the other two sets of legs. I'm going to put a 12 inch timber on both sides and then lock it on two square connectors. Now if we were only making a bridge deck, we could have made these timbers shorter and just put a bridge deck and you would have a small bridge. Do you want to cut a bridge and make those longer so that we can add a roof to our bridge? To make the bridge deck we're going to use a large panel and two small panels. And you'll place these end to end and then we'll put a velcro T to connect them together. With the same thing over here, you'll just feed the velcro T through the notch and then up underneath the large panel through the notch and then back over to lock it into place. Then you'll place your bridge deck on top of your legs. We're going to make these a little bit farther apart so that we can link them together with the roof on. Now we're going to place 24 inch timbers this is what I was talking about when I said moving them farther apart. We make it just far enough apart that they'll fit in the end notches of these 24 inch timbers. I'm going to add a 3 inch timber and put a square connector on each side. You'll do that for all four sides. You'll put the other 24 inch timber on the other side and then add your 3 inch connectors in your square your squares to lock it into place. Then you'll place two triangles on top of your rotating notch timbers that you originally put in as legs. Then you'll put the two large panels together with Velcro tees. Feed it through. This is what we did the bridge deck. And this will make your roof. Feed it in one large panel and then up underneath and through the other panel. You'll do that. You place these side by side where you place the other end to end. And then we're going to put the roof panels on top of the triangles. And now you have a covered bridge. 